focusing on you. Innovations in modern medicine from your team of experts at UHealth, the University of Miami Health System. When her older sister's memory started to wane, Carolyn Banks wondered about her own brain health. Forgetting things, forgetting some words, forgetting some names, you know, I was just concerned. Dr. Margaret Paracek Vance, a human geneticist and director of the John P. Hussman Institute for Human Genomics, says research shows Miami-Dade County has the highest prevalence of Alzheimer's in the country. Hispanic and African Americans have a one and a half to two-fold increased risk of Alzheimer's compared to people with non-Hispanic European individuals. The goal is to identify people early enough to identify those at the highest risk and then be able to intervene and prevent the process. Here in the lab at the University of Miami Hussman Institute, researchers work with blood samples to sequence genes. The goal is to help identify the causes of Alzheimer's and to develop treatments and therapies for all populations. Everybody has these genes. Why does this particular variant or this change, what is the mechanism that makes it give you an increased risk for Alzheimer's? We identify the genes, then we have to understand the mechanism. Participation in diverse studies like the Dawn Project is key. We try to get 13,000 individuals. 4,000 Hispanic Latinos, uh, 4,000 African Americans, and then 5,000 Africans over the next five years. Carolyn joined to further the research. We did something with some numbers, with some drawings. Exercising your brain and social interaction is critical. Carolyn stays active through her church. She hopes her involvement and UM's work will help others like her sister. I'm happy to be involved, reaching out to the community to get involved. We need to be engaged, to be educated.